JV2 going to glutamate. My goat is my goat. Come back and losers, okay? We're going over season 22. We're gonna be seeing uh Vernius versus Bust and Bones. Vernius versus Ray okay. Luno. Ray Luno. Yeah, sitting here in a honestly a like, really decent lead. I mean, Vernius, of course, like the one thing he's using is I, I peek over a little oh. bit. Oh I was gonna say, using those projectiles, being projectile forward and keeping his Bayo at bay, because if Ooh. you don't keep the Bayo at bay, oh. they're gonna be Going for those crazy moves to take your socks ludicrously early. Ray Lulu finally coming to life here in this set. That drag down there to down smash was kind of crispy. Hold on a minute, Vernius. I was not familiar with your game. Like my sandwich earlier today. Crispy chicken sandwich. Ooh, love to see it. Gonna be seeing a little bit of Ray come through once more. No. As we get another combo started here onto Vernius. And what's he gonna do here? We go round to the ledge, we go do a little bit air dodge, and we actually find a way to reverse the positioning in every situation. Now it's Ray kind of in the back, not even kind of, but no very much in the back seat. So much so that we're going wow. to the next game, actually. My god. Yeah, very. Bernie's playing hot. You know who he beat to get here? 
Sean Numbers. Whoa. Ooh, this, this is, this is the Wii it. Fit Slayer, yes. apparently. Dude, you gotta and stop all it lying. took was changing to Pit. Not Dark Pit. Pit. Stop lying. Well, I was looking at it. No, you stop lying. You knew that. Stop I'm being lying. harassed. Good. Um, Ver <laughs> Vernie is going up one over Ray Luno, and again, just using the strengths of his character to his absolute advantage. Right? Like using those. I mean, oh, not the, the biggest yeah. disjoint, but this one's nonetheless. So playing around. Bayo's immediate range and not forcing into, himself into any situations against that character. And those arrows doing so much for you. Coming in the meantime, we can uh, close out this.
is, is Kazuya. We're going to go over to oh, yeah. Ray Luna versus Renias, which is going over to a game three, I want to say. Game three, game three. Back three. on Hollow Bastion. And again, very strong solo start for either player here. I love the use of that Arbiter's there, actually, to uh, push Ray Luna outside to get out of that combo and then force you into back position. As Bane, you never want to overextend, just like, especially against a character with such explosive hitboxes like Dark Pick. Because, of yeah. course, he can take those, especially at 83. And how light Bane was, you can just lose a stock really, really early. We're seeing Freddy is oh. going for the down air and upside. He doesn't find it just yet, but I like the idea. He's already looking out for the stock there. <gasps> oh! No, had the right vision, the wrong spacing. I just like how he chained one one electro shock into the other. There we go. Freddy is finally there with the forward throw. I mean, this Dark Pit is looking fantastic. And then playing so patiently here, too, recognizing he's up and saying, okay, I have absolutely no obligation to approach you now. Up a stock, you know the vibes. It do be that time, don't it? And Vernius is really just showing how well this character's been buffed over the years, especially in, like, the second to last patch. Oh, yeah. Like, Orbiters did not used to be that good. Oh, yeah, definitely using those changes on Dark Pit. Oh, wow. Right, and then... Just Utilizing his disjoint to the absolute max, whether it's using the arrows to take the stocks on Bayo, or just keeping the space just like this from way that platform. Saying, I'm not approaching Bayo on Hollow Bastard platform. I have absolutely no business being over there. The second you overextend, that's when I find my damage. Exactly. You're completely right here. Good rapid damage, uh, rapid attack damage coming in through uh, through onto Ray Luno, and then coupling it with the Nair. Gonna be seeing 73% on them right here, and finally they get something started going in for the uh, the side the, the side kick into the up air. But is it gonna be enough? No. Vernon's gonna become completely in negating it for a second, but then Ray is right back into it for a couple of hits and then finds a way to remain uh, kind of in the, in the uh, uh, aggressivity for a second there. Oh, the drag down up here. Hold on. This could be something. Start something beautiful. Hold. Hold. Okay. I'm just fading out, I agree. Oh, that was a really good time there. Into the yep, yep. Sniped. Do it again. Do it again. Clip her, clip her wings. No. Nope, Target nope. locked. Oh, that was a really well done up, uh, up tilt coming in from Vernius. Can we see it again? Oh, that! My bad! Yeah, that dash tag got buffed too. That that kills that kills now. That was fast! Yeah. That was fast and it killed killed. Just said, yoop, up and away. I mean, now Vernius is putting Ray Little down to their final stock here and up still 1-1 uh, one, one, game three in the set looking to knock them down to losers. Mm -hmm. Comes up tilt in the back here coming out again, but still hanging on here. Great DI here from the start bit. And again, using those Arbiters in a very good position to make it back as Bayo. Because Bayo takes so many stocks in that specific position on the stage and still hanging on just perfectly there. Now, one count Ray out yet. Um. This Edgar is going, is doing wonders for Ray. Coming, kind of brought them out of a really bad situation against Vernius for just a couple of seconds there, and it built up enough percentage on Vernius to make him a little bit more scared, a little more careful with how he approaches. Look at that! Even be able to scoop up that approach uh -oh. from the ledge, and now what do you do? You make it back narrowly, the skin of your teeth. You get that tail attack coming through as well. Now, what is the option against Ray, who's only at sub uh, sub sixty percent? Max rage in this dark, but you can definitely make some yeah, crazy Yeah, this is here. Uh, this is dangerous right now. If I'm Ray, I'm choosing my approaches very carefully. Oh, not careful we, enough. Yeah, we that's, that's went through we it. We do it, man. We ball. And now Ray Luna at 82%, though. A decent amount of reach on this Bayonetta. You know, uh, maybe a conversion, honestly, a conversion away from taking this whole game in his favor. Oh, he, had the, he went for the hard yeah. read. Getting way too overzealous there with that Electroshock. This Bayonetta just trying to find even more damage. He's not going to find really anything just yet, but the bash oh didn't come in and clutter Ray Luna there. I think even Ray got a little bit too overzealous trying to punish that uh, that mistake from Vernius off stage, but you know they didn't get the twenty percent off of it. Raised at one hundred five percent, getting a little bit of advantage here. Oh. And unfortunately, Rise, I say that Vernius finds a way to bring it back for themselves. Very nice. The set going to.